This is code.org and we are a theme park manager. Oh no, a theme park manager wants to keep track of the roller coasters they have at the park. Don't know why we can't be the manager, but fine. Write a parameterized constructor in the rollercoaster.java class to assign specific values to the name, speed, and instance variable. So let's head over here and okay, looks like they gave us a constructor, but they want a parameter to parameterize one. Wow. Struggling with that. So I'm actually going to just go ahead, guys, and copy this. Literally, copy, go down here. And I'm going to do control V or command uh, V on a Mac, paste, because it's going to be the same kind of. Now we need parameters in here. So what do they want? Specific values to the name and speed. Okay, so I'm going to say, um, string, and I don't know, I'll call this new name, maybe, comma, and then uh, the speed, well, that could be a string, I'm going to assume it's an int, uh, and we can double check, yep, it's an int, and I'm going to be original and do new speed, right, you can call this whatever you want, you can name this Fred if you want, you just got to keep it the same down here, and now I'm going to kill this off and do new name, and kill this off and do new speed. All right, so this is all looking good. You could also just do name, but then make sure you use the this dot um, dot annotation to specify the instant variables up here. So that all looks good. Check uh, in the roller coaster runner dot Java instantiate a roller coaster object using the parameterized constructor. Okay, that's easy enough. So I'm gonna be lazy again and just go copy. So I will do. Um, uh, my, or I'll just be, call it coaster, and that's going to be equal to new roller coaster. Now, what do I want to name it? Can I name it whatever I want? Yes. Okay. So I'm going to say fun hill because a roller coaster is like a hill. I'm not known for my naming of roller coasters. Um, it's, it's not really a, a thing for teachers. Uh, we'll space speeds 45. Okay, and so this is instantiating my new object coaster, and it's going to set the name variables, instant variables, and the speed using this constructor. And the reason it knows to call this constructor is because I have parameters. If I had no parameters here, we would still have a coaster object, the name would be unknown, the speed would be 20. Print the constructor and the values assigned to the instant uh, instance variables for the roller coaster object. Okay, so now we just need to print this all out. And I'll just go with a system dot out dot print and I'll do LM for new line. Uh, and there's a few ways I can do this debating. Um, oh, of course, these are private, right? So these are going to be private. And so what I actually need to use is these methods. Right. And so you will often see this. You can't go about it this way. You don't have direct access. Get name and get speed. And boom. Ba -ba -ba -da, roller coaster, fun hill, speed 45. I've seen students split this up on separate lines. How you print it is kind of up to you. Um, yeah, let's just see. Boom, boom, boom. Awesome. Cool. Onward. Onward.